Hello and welcome to the day 9 of the stitch along. Today we will embroider the table, which is actually like a small chair, the mug with cocoa and marshmallow and the candle. We're gonna go by color, starting with our favorite brown, 3863. Thread three strands. I'm gonna start with the legs. We're doing them the same as uh, legs for the chair. At first one side, then we're doing the next side and going towards the center. I already filled the area here, but I still have the hole here. So I'm gonna do the stitch, placing the end kind of under the existing stitches. And I see a little hole here. So I'm gonna do the same. For this stitch along, I divided the parts to be equal, so you will have a little bit of stitching every day. But this part is pretty short. Usually I embroider it by color. I take one and use it everywhere, everywhere where I see it. Now we're making horizontal side stitches. Make sure you're covering the start of the legs. I'm filling the mug with cocoa by making a few for split stitches. Okay, then secure thread and come back with white color thread at three strands. The mug is made with horizontal satin stitches and the handle is made with split stitches. So I'm gonna start with the handle, go along the line. Starting stitches. And make a couple of stitches throughout the cocoa. These are the marshmallows. Secure thread and prepare color for one tree. The candle is just two stitches. I'm finishing them into the same hole. Then I'm securing thread. I'm preparing the next color, 3822. I'm coming up through the hole where I ended the stitches and making two, three short stitches. Also, I just recently realized that the fire is very close to the curtain, which is questionable choice, but I like the composition. I'm leaving it this way. Secure the thread and get back to me with three strands of 991 threaded. So I'm making a little bit of pine tree under the candle. These are the stitches that go to different size, but coming back down into the same kind of area. Make them a little bit chaotic. Uh, they shouldn't all end in one point, but they should be close. I think this is our shortest day, but don't be fooled. <laughs> Tomorrow we're gonna do more stitching. This is a day nine. Instructions will be linked in the description. And thank you for joining this stitch along. In the next videos, we're gonna add more and more decorations. It's gonna look more and more pretty. Show your processes with Tech Family Stitch Stitch Along, and I'll see you in the next video.